This is the best value hotel in the whole Sri Lanka. Look at this. As you can see, we have the whole hotel for ourselves. We have a really nice, like, main area, beautiful artwork, nice kitchen. We have our familiar bedroom. It's a little bit disorganized, so really don't look at that. Nice bathroom. And the main part is this old pool for us. That's the best, definitely. What do you, you know the best say? part? This is all ten pounds per night. Bargain. So as we say, this is probably the best value hotel in all of Sri Lanka. I can't imagine something being a better bang for the buck, but it's kind of a little bit sad as to the reason why we got such a good deal. We turned up and the gate was locked. So we called the owner and we were like, we've got a booking and they were completely surprised. Anyway, it turns out, I think the place has been closed for a little while. Doesn't look like any tourists have been here at all, unfortunately. I think that's the uh, result of the economic crisis here in Sri Lanka. So the result is we basically have free reign of the whole hotel. They've just given us the keys to the gate, keys to the hotel, and we're the only ones staying here. So yeah, best value hotel in all Sri Lanka by accident, unfortunately. Hopefully more people come in the future. But right now we're gonna go out on a little adventure. I wanna get a new shirt. I don't have any Sri Lanka shirts yet, so let's go see. So I was driving down the road yesterday and I actually uh, came across a guy on the street selling uh, shirts and other parts of clothes and said to him like, what time do you start here? At 9 a.m. By this point it was late in the afternoon and it didn't really look like it sold much. He was pretty excited to see a potential customer but unfortunately he didn't have anything in my size. And so he said to me if I come back tomorrow he'll have some things that fit me so that's where we're going now, see if we can make this guy's day. Train is coming. Doesn't look like somebody here. Yeah. Hey, how are you? Did you bring those bigger sizes? Yeah, yeah. These other ones, he's got all like vintage stuff. Like... This is the kind of one that I want. Additional Sri Lanka. I mean, I fit in, right?
I'm going to offend anyone if I get this. I'm sure it's okay. <laughs> Blind and a few people driving past it. <laughs> yeah, I just need to work on my tan a little bit. <laughs> How's that look? You look really nice, my amour. You look very handsome in there. I think I might get very hot in it, like it's quite thick material, but... It looks really nice. That kind of uh, top makes you feel, you know, makes you look really nice. very handsome. What's your name? I'm, I'm Rosne. You are? Rosne. Rosne. Yeah. Rosne the... We have here Rosne, the <laughs> shirt seller in Sri Lanka. Oh, thanks. Right? Yeah. <laughs> in Nagumbo. We're in Nagumbo, by the way, <laughs> on the main road, so... Yeah, thank okay. you so much. <laughs> hopefully, hopefully some people who watch our video can oh, really? find you. Yeah, wow. hopefully. We're going to make like, we're traveling all around Triangle for three months. Oh, really? So we're going to make videos from every place that we go. So yeah. hopefully people can come and find your yeah. shop and then you can come buy some Yeah. Yeah, I'll take it. Okay. I'll buy it. Okay. Uh, we said like 200, right? Oh, uh, <laughs> see now. <laughs> <laughs> no worries. Okay. Take break. No, you keep that's okay. No, 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 that's honestly. No, 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 that's you. That's for you. Okay. That's for you. No, that's your money. No, 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 no. Okay. That's your money. Oh, no, thank you so much. You're welcome. Thank you. They look really, really nice. I'm very happy with that purchase. Look at proper Sri Lanka man. Now he's ready to go to the tea now. <laughs> You see now, I'm not going to take this off now. No, just forever, it's Pilanka, man. Go. Thanks so much. Thank you very much. Yeah, Have so a good day. Bye. <laughs> see you later. <laughs> Look at this car as well, what Mini Cooper. That's very nice. Yeah, I'm happy with my shirt. You look very amazing on it. I'm happy with my shirt, but it's definitely a little bit hotter wearing this than the uh, the beach shirt. A long <laughs> while. I'm feeling very, very hot and very humid now, so maybe I won't wear it every day. But I'm happy with my purchase, and I'm happy to help a local business. So next up on the Sri Lankan shopping list, as you can see, I'm looking like a fine smartly groomed English gentleman at the moment. Nothing like a bedraggled traveler in the slightest. However, I could do with a little tidy. There's no denying it. So we're going to head now, see if we can find a Sri Lankan barber who can fix me up for the next three months of this road trip. Let's go. Let's hope we can find a solution for that. You're the master barber? No. no. <laughs> okay. I'm putting my life in your hands now. So I'm growing my hair long. So I don't want no cut foot here. Yes. So you see like this. Ah, yes. So just tidy. Always problem here around the edge. Okay. So if you can tidy all of this part, that would be great. No, I don't think so. 
So this is what I've shown him. See if you can work miracles. How's it looking? Looking very fancy. Looking, fancy. looking very, very nice. Do you want to grab it? Huh? How are we doing? Well, I'm not regretting it yet, so that's a good sign. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so this is the uh, the big one now. I don't really ever trust people cutting my beard, so this is a this is a big thing for you. Okay. You want? No, you hold <laughs> Yeah, I can hold it. <laughs> So many times when I've been traveling, hmm? when I've been traveling before, ah, yeah. the, the barbers cut my beard and they always do it bad. So I don't have much trust. So I, I hope, I hope you do good. Yes. <laughs> I read on Google that you are brothers, right? Yes. Yeah. You, you have very good reviews on Google. Mm. Shorter, aren't we? Oh, it's all gone. <laughs> it's gone. It looks nice. You like? I oh, know you like. <laughs> you cut it. Looks good. Much better. Much better. Let's see. Thanks for good. It gives you That's so nice. It's a bit of a sh it's shocking. <laughs> it's nice. Your mom, seriously, your mom and your family would be so happy right now. How much do I owe you? <laughs> the change is okay, don't worry. Thank you. Okay, me, I don't think I need to cut my beard now for the next six months, do I? It's the first time that I've seen your beard so short. It's yeah. so short. Shortest that I've ever had my beard in like, in like four years. Ah. Ah. Oh my god, you look great. Are you ready? Are you ready? Okay. Get your helmet. Okay. Thanks so much. Thank you. Bye bye. I feel like maybe I have like post-traumatic syndrome right now. I have a, a, a very strong connection to my beard. So when it's cut so short, I don't really recognize myself in the mirror. And right now, oh my God, I look so strange. You look handsome, you look amazing. You look like a new person. You look really great. What do you think? You look amazing. We're going to finish up today's video here on one of the beaches in the Gumbo. Probably one of the best things about being here is just the sunsets, the colours in the sky. This is tame as well. Normally it's like way more powerful than this, but just look at the view. Beach going really far, all the palm trees, little fishermen's houses. 
same that way as well. Good view. Trying not to have an accident. Oh. So on a gumbo, God, I don't know what to make of this hair at the minute. What do you reckon? I'll grow into it, is what they say. I'm certainly not sure about the beard. I like the hair, but anyway, the view is fantastic. Nagumbo is probably one of the most touristy spots in all of Sri Lanka because it's right next to the airport where people are coming and going. So you look around, I mean, not in this section here, but certainly further down the beach that way. It's all big hotels and stuff, but as we go and explore more of Sri Lanka, get into the little villages, down the country roads, off the beaten path, you'll start to see more of why this country is so beautiful and famed around the world. But from here, on the rocks of Nagumbo, with the sunset, we'll leave it here. Over and out. Ciao. Bye.